Bluefin Labs uses public social media commentary paired with linear television feeds to analyze and organize viewer engagement with TV shows and commercials. We call this big data set the TV Genome. This visualization is generated using a sampling of data from Bluefin's TV Genome database. Pictured here are people in social media. The lines that connect them are their social graph, friends on Facebook and followers on Twitter. The second plane below is TV. It shows the programs and commercials being aired as people comment about them using social media. Over the course of 2011, Bluefin analyzed and organized social TV data for over 346,000 telecasts of U.S. national television. U.S. national TV commercials are also analyzed and organized by Bluefin's platform. Using semantic analysis and machine learning techniques, the critical connective tissue that ties the social graph and the TV content graph together emerges. Each of the links rendered here is an actual connection made between something someone said and a piece of content on TV. By tracing the path of one piece of content that drives someone to comment on it, and following where that comment goes, a specific social graph becomes activated. You can then trace back to see the relationship between that social graph and content, representing a virtual living room of co-viewers. A piece of television content causes someone to talk. They talk to other people, which drives tune-in behavior back into mass media and fuels the overall feedback cycle. Emerging within the social graph are influencers with a propensity to talk about what's on TV. These individuals are followed by many people, and their content has a high fan-out rate. We call these people Pro-Am Media Critics. By visualizing these relationships, you can see the people who are the key links in connecting mass media and social media together. Sometimes, it's actually a piece of content that is special. For example, President Obama's 2011 State of the Union Address. Using this data set and scale, you can see that the engagement properties of this broadcast are truly remarkable. During the State of the Union, our nation exploded into conversation about what the President was saying. Through all of these lines flows unstructured language, data that can be analyzed to get a real-time pulse of a nation, a real-time sense of the social reactions being activated by content. As our world becomes increasingly instrumented and we have the capabilities to collect and connect the dots between what people are saying and the context they're saying it in, what's emerging is an ability to see new social structures and dynamics that have previously not been seen.